This edition of the Riddler Report is brought to you by PortCityCoin.com Windows are the legitimate and self-defensive discorporate into warfare of conquest. At what point it is defiance against wickedness become of that very thing. For the Federalists who rule America with not much federalism, that Rubicon was crossed 16 years ago. If one is being charitable toward the seat at Washington and the place where it was forded then, it is uh, perhaps being forded again uh, on the mass of uh, sweltering sand allegedly uh, controlled uh, by the Republic of Iraq. Uh, the United States of uh, perpetually scared people has moved to withdraw its non-emergency personnel from their presumably fortified offices when located in the Kurdish regions so restrained and moderate for their neighborhood so hopeful of their independence and so recently betrayed by the rulers at Baghdad and their their, uh, their minders in the district of casualties the Montenegrin Nazi fighter turned uh, dissident may have uh, thought it best when he uh, when he claimed it, at least uh, through his actions and predictions don't trust headlines trust history the terrified Americans have pointed to uh, what they perceive as their ancient enemy Iran exclaiming that the Islamic Republic so called is up to something while we are upon uh, the subject of history let us uh, ask ourselves what uh, what might they be up to if the pages of the past are any source of legitimate guidance uh, then we should ask are they uh, are they planning a coup uh, as the Americans uh, perpetrated upon them uh, in the 1950s when they installed the murderous Shah. Are they, uh, are they aiming to gun down an airliner as the Americans did to them uh, full of passengers uh, in the 1980s? Are they uh, planning to invade a neighboring region with their armies as America's uh, co-belligerent Iraq once did to them but as, uh, but as the Iranians have done to no one in hundreds of years uh, but we may, we may be certain that they have still got a sank up their sleeves for look how closely they place their country to our military bases Cruel on large scales to their own, as all governments are, or have been thus far, embedded in the ancient statecraft of coercion. Alleged terrorism, perhaps, are not always just alleged. And deniability. The center at Tehran is not to be idolized. The claims of deadly intrigue 
by Federalist liars is not always a lie. But oh, how feeble has become the cry of the Bolton who called Wolf in its veracity over the course of this 16 year a marrow jihad and yet uh, uh, during it how many nations have been struck down by his kind and this empire a little more warning his kind which is not our kind are the bringers of the medievalist torture chambers the finger collections the renewed slave trade at Libya and the violations of children followed as in the case of Abir Hamza by the assassinations of her family to cover it up it is rarely those with the most guilt who suffer the most grief. It is not for us, uh, the small people, to know what is really happening. We may not know for decades, or perhaps ever, uh, but we do know this. Read my lips, no new taxes. I did not have sex with that woman, Ms. Lewinsky. And Iraq has weapons of mass destruction. If you are so unwise as to comport with a, uh, an unquestioning demeanor toward these representations, then willingly join with them and their imperial works of unending expansion and cruelty of conflict which violates Sun Tzu's every admonition then you are beyond help and perhaps undeserving of it rare coins pawns gold and silver bullion. Check out Port City Coin in Portsmouth, New Hampshire for your precious metal needs. A plus rated with the Better Business Bureau, happy to do a cash transaction. Why buy your metals from one of those slave state mints when you can support the free state economy? Visit PortCityCoin.com or as I like to call it, PortCityCoin.com